Okay. okay. So, hi. Hi. So, you've just launched the Huawei Y9 2019 yeah. in Kenya. Could you tell us more about, about the phone and how it fits into your existing portfolio? So, for this phone, we have big mi memory and for plus 64, we have big battery and 4000 mAh. And also, we have four AI camera. So, based on the consumer request, okay, we want to give consumer more benefit experience. And they want to take good photo. They want to use the phone long time, long life. They also want to use big memory. So, we want to introduce this phone to this market to meet all the consumer needs. So, and how does it fit into your existing portfolio? Because you already have the Y5. The Y7. So how does it? So very serious that we forecast on the Kenya market and also from the uh, young guy and they use the phone very frequently and for one night we uh, we think in the high performance than Y5 and Y7 because they belong to di different segment and also Y9 we update upgrade so many specification like we have a big battery big memory and more camera. So it's, it's, it's experience is better than the other two phones. And also the other two phones also match different segment consumers. So in your opinion, do you think when you're looking at consumer, do, do the consumers want just a basic smartphone that they can use on their day-to-day -day basis? Or do they want a powerful device that they can do more with it when they're going about their days? So our, our marketing and retail strategy is very clear and we only want, want to forecast let consumer know this product and let the consumer know where to buy. So we will forecast the main retailers give some branding and some uh, live demo to experience it. Uh, you can go to the like all over country retailer shops, you can sell it. So and what are your sales projections for maybe this device? How many are you expecting to sell and how many have been pre-ordered already? So for the quality, I think be uh, based on the consumer request. Okay, we want to sell more and more, but our purpose maybe not forecast the quantity. We only want to forecast the consumer experience. Once consumer experience very well, maybe uh, we can sell very very good quantity. So and now speaking about Huawei Mobile in general. So what's your market share in Kenya, and what are you doing to either increase that? Uh, considering what the competitors are already doing in the market. So also for Huawei strategy in the Kenya is also very clear. Also we want we want to invest invest some marketing budget to let our brand and our smartphone awareness and uh, to reach every consumer. So we have a very clear marketing plan for this market. So and for your launch, you are partnering with Jumia to push the devices. You have been doing this for a while. What have been your experience so far? And is it good? Is it bad? So, as you know, Jumia is an online shop. Also, most of the consumer want to buy the goods from online. So Jumia also in this country is very big. So we want the cooperation with each other, give consumer more convenient to buy the stocks. So. They have a good relationship with Jumia. Thank you. So, and with the, when you launched the Mate 10, you went to Jumia. When you launched this, so I, I'm trying to understand which devices are you selling more through Jumia? Are they the high end or the basic ones like the Wi-Fi? So, as you know, for the online shopping, I think not very popular in this country, but also have some consumer want to buy online. So for the future plan. If we have opportunity and a chance, we can together with online shops, we can together with the other. No problem. No. Okay. And about the Met 20 Pro and the Met 20 Pro, I have to ask, when are they coming to Kenya? Anytime soon? Uh, until now, our plan is December. We want to introduce our new Met series in this market. So the plans are already in place? Yeah, already in place. Okay. Thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you.